Hello everyone, just wanted to take you through registration system, uh, like how exhibitor registration system works basically. So where you can log in and where you can generate badges for your team. So we will be talking all about that. So let's get started. So like initially you will be receiving an email from Sade team uh, with username and the password. Now this username and password use uh, you can use on this particular link. You will also get the link where you can click and you, you will be landing on this page. So where you can use this username, login in. So like once I'm logged in, so I'll be seeing this one like where I can see all my basic details, like allocated to boot size, the total number of badges, which are like over here, I have seven number of badges allocated to me. And uh, right now I have used zero badges. So over here I can go and I can manage my badges, badges, like if I want to go and manage my badges, like after, if I want to create new badges, I can go here and I can create, like I can also come and share so I'll directly go here. So there are three options are available. One is invite a user. If I have a basic detail, I can directly go and I can just add on to those basic detail and I can invite them. And if I have a complete detail, I can go and I can, I can add that complete detail. Like I can select your exhibitor. I want whether I want to create exhibitor badge or I want to create service badge. So those options are there we can select and we can take forward so the third option is excel sheet so this option is also there like if i have multiple records and i want to upload in one go so i can use this excel sheet options so where like I can download the sample, like there will be a, you, you will be able to see a sample sheet options. Like over here, I've downloaded. And I've done some alterations over here. Like I will be creating two badges. One is for exhibitor and one is for service. So this is very important part where I have to specify whether I want exhibitor or service because this is very mandatory part. After that, the name and the email ID. The name and the email ID should be unique one because we, re we required unique records uh, of, uh, on one particular email ID. There will be only one account. Similarly, there won't be a duplicate email phone number allowed and it should be a WhatsApp number so that once you are added, so you can get badges on your mobile itself. So we here I'll be using this email. I'll be showing you one sample. So like over here, I can mention my first name, uh, title, first name, last name, email ID, alternate mobile number if I have, alternate email ID, sorry, mobile number, mobile code, and mobile number, and the company name, there are to mention company name. To mention company name and similarly designation and emergency contact details are not mandatory if you have you can put or you can skip this so now i'll import this sheet Hmm. So only one record has been added and details not saved on line number three registration failed because email ID was already used. As I told, we required unique email ID. 
so it's like that so i'll go and edit my sheet one more time i'll change my email id let's see what is watching Now I have added successfully two records. One is service batch and second one is exhibitor batch. Now successfully this come. Uh, now you will be seeing that the status, there is a status in draft. This shows that my current application is in draft state, which I have to submit and get approval from accounting. Like once it is approved, then we can able to receive the badges. So, I'll click on submit for approval. Once I click, so it will be asking me for the confirmation. I'll give my confirmation. And once it's submitted, so now you can see this will be in under review. That now your badges are in the, now your informations are under review from uh, Sate team. So once this, uh, uh this is verified by sade team uh, after that you will be receiving your badges in case if you want to add extra uh, request for an extra badge you can obviously go and request for extra badges from here like once you click so it will be asking like how many badges like i requested for two extra badges for exhibitor and two three for service request now <coughs> So this shows that my requests are under pending. So now the account team will verify with the update. So once this request is approved, so the similar badges will be allocated. I hope this helped you. So thanks a lot.